today we're going to finish our letter projects for Art to Remember. I'm going to finish decorating with crayon and then paint the background with paint. If you don't have watercolor paints, it's perfectly okay for you to do this entire thing in crayon, or you might even be doing it on Autodesk Sketchbook on your iPad. And any of the ways are just fine. Um, if you're using crayon, since this is for art to remember and we will be painting over some of this, make sure you're pressing down hard and coloring nice and dark with your crayons. I'm gonna speed it up so it goes a little bit quicker. As I was coloring, I made sure that I added some texture or decorations to every part of my picture so that nothing was left plain. Now I can go ahead and start adding paint to fill the rest of my picture with color. As you are painting, make sure you fill in shapes nice and solid. And remember, less water is going to give you brighter colors. Also, this is watercolor paint, so you need to keep adding water to it so your paints don't dry out. Okay, that looks pretty good. Once you get done, get done painting your artwork, take a picture, use Autodesk Sketchbook to put your name on it, and then upload your artwork to Canvas. For parents who have students working at home, if you are interested in purchasing any Art to Remember products, I will either send home or post directions for how you can upload their artwork to the website. And then for everybody, I will be sending home ordering information later probably sometime in October, so be looking for it. Have fun, everyone. Take care.